Fuck you. There's a four door. I don't know how far along here he comes. trick of switching your weapon back and forth so you never click on the on the grating. Yeah, I don't know what this is. So calm bullets. Really? Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna kill him, and if there's anything worth getting... Ah. What? <sighs> I just have to wait. I was trying to like do this faster, but... What's in this freaking room? Mind detector, ration. Okay. There's nothing worth getting. It's not. It's not worth getting. Mind detector is a stupid item anyway. You bastard. Bear with me a minute here. I'm gonna try to do this as expediently as possible. He didn't see me, didn't see me, didn't see me, didn't see me. Okay. Not the most stealthy way to get around that situation, but... I didn't want to bore you people waiting for him to walk by and yada yada. That guy's always been a kind of a pain get around without killing him. Especially not for a mind detector. But that does lead me to wonder... Whoa! Fuck! <laughs> Ugh. So that does lead me to wonder, though, where, um, where do I get the body armor? I cannot remember. It might be in Otacon, that room where Otacon is, with all the gas. I don't know where else it would be. It's not on this floor. There's no more doors here. Alright. Well, that was a big waste of time. All I got was SOCOM bullets. Hopefully all these things are gone, and they're not. Son of a bitch. I don't remember all these stupid things. I told you to... Uh, I pressed X, I swear to God. Snake just decided he was going to be frickin' twat and not duck. So many mines. They even put in more mines since last time. Oh, there's one that almost killed me. Is there... nope. Nothing. Ooh, what are you? Grenade! Uh, 
Wow, where is that body armor? I might not be able to get it until later. But where is it? I don't remember. I'll check the... That's what I'm thinking. I think the level 6 card is one of the highest cards you get in the game. Like, I mean, I, I think it only goes up to, like, level 7 or 8. If that, I think it actually might top out at 6. I really don't remember, but... But... So if you're not understanding what we're doing at this part of the game, we're just going back to where Sniper Wolf captured us. So the little alleyway where, um, where Meryl got shot, we're going back to that area. Because we want to go further than we got last time. But I do want to check these rooms to see if there's anything I've missed in terms of items, because I know there are a few items that I don't have yet. Are you medicine? Well, yeah, that's if you catch a cold, I think. Diazepam, we will need that. Vomus, vomus, vomus. Uh, don't see me, don't see me, don't see me. Okay. So it's a four, three, four and three, so I've seen, I've been in all these rooms before. Shouldn't be anything new in any of these rooms. Uh. Nikita, Nikita, Nikita. Oh, hi, guard. So, there's one more room I want to check for items before we continue with the story here. That's one floor down, and that's the only other room we haven't checked yet since I've gotten a level 6 card. Besides the armory, but I don't think there's any other doors in the armory. Let's see if I can call Campbell about these stupid... To get to the underground base. Ah, whatever. Basically, they describe what these doors, those little pockets of air are doing. One, four, three, seen all these already. Gonna make these on my chaff. Six, haha, so this is the new door, let's see what we can get. Body armor! That's exactly what I was looking for. Okay. Let's just see what's in here for just and giggles. Grenade, grenade, grenade. Nikita. Okay. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. Okay, so now we have the body armor, which is what I was looking for. Put the gas mask back on for a little bit. So the body armor, whenever you equip it, lets you only take half damage. As you can see, that's without it, that's with it. So it actually shows up on Snake's body, which is pretty cool. Let's see if uh, Nastasha says anything about it. You found body armor. It will lower the damage you take from gunfire. It is designed to prevent bullets from penetrating, but you will still feel the impact from the bullets. Don't rely on it too much. Okay. So it's pretty handy to have in some boss fights, although you have to be careful because if you have it equipped, you obviously can't have rations equipped, which means if you die, you won't automatically use a ration. So you kind of have to stay on top of your health while using it, but... It's pretty handy to have. Oh, 
Okay, yeah, so that handkerchief that we got from Otacon will help us out here. And let us explore a little more.